Do you have advice in general for people? You've already exceptionally successful. You're young, but do you have advice for young people starting out in college or maybe in high school? You know, advice for their career, advice for their life, how to um, pave a successful path in career and life. I would say just be hungry. Uh, like always be hungry for what you want. And I think like I've been inspired by a lot of people who are just like driven and who really like go for what they want, no matter what, like you shouldn't want it, you should need it. So if you need something, you basically go towards the ends to make it work. How do you know when you, you come across a thing that that's like you need? I think there's not going to be any single thing that you're going to need. There are going to be different types of things that you need. But whenever you need something, you just go push for it. And of course, once you, you may not get it, or you may find that this was not even the thing that you were looking for, it might be a different thing. But the point is, like, you're pushing through things, and that actually gives you, brings a lot of skills and brings a lot of, uh, like, builds a certain kind of attitude, which will probably help you get the other thing. Once you figure out what's really the thing that you want. Yeah, I think a lot of people are, are... I've noticed the kind of afraid of that is because one, it's the fear of commitment. Mm -hmm. And two, there's so many amazing things in this world. You almost don't want to miss out on all the other amazing things by committing to this one thing. Right. So I think a lot of it has to do with just allowing yourself to uh, like notice that thing and uh, just go all the way with it. I mean, I also like failure, right? So yeah, I know this is like super cheesy that, you know, failure is something that you should be prepared for and so on. But I do think, I mean, especially in research, for example, failure is something that happens almost like, almost every day is like <laughs> experiments failing and not yeah. working. And so you really need to be so used to it. Mm. You need to have a thick skin. But, uh, and only basically through, uh, like when you get through it is when you find the one thing that's actually working. Mm -hmm. so like Thomas Edison was like one person like that, right? So I really, like when I was a kid, I used to really read about how he uh, found like the filament, mm. the light bulb filament. And then he, I think his thing was like, he tried 990 things that didn't work or something of the sort. <laughs> yeah. And then they asked him like, so what did you learn? Uh, because all of these were failed experiments. And then he says, oh, these 990 things don't, don't work. And I know that. Did you know that? <laughs> I mean, yeah, that's, that's pretty brilliant. inspiring.